everybody and welcome along to what will probably be my most expensive stream ever. Today I'm going to be gifting a sub in my Twitch channel for every single time that I come off my bike on TT Isle of Man 3. No, we'll not be switching off simulation mode. Simulation mode is staying on. I will be using traction control and ABS, just like they use in real life, but that doesn't change from yesterday. And uh, I do still want to win. So if you're not subscribed and you fancy a free sub, today's probably the day. Although I will try <laughs> and not give you subs, but I suspect that's not going to go very well. But right, we're going to do it, guys. We're going to do it. 20 minutes, basically non-stop. I mean, under 20 minutes is the dream. And obviously, ideally, no crashes, but that's not going to happen. Come on, guys. We're in 25 crashes right now. We've got the best tyres now, though. We should have start immediately. But we're going to do the full course of the Isle of Man TT. I've, I've done parts of this. Uh oh. In parts. But I've obviously never done the full course. Come on. Uh, why have I got full front in there? Very wide. Just being careful not to scrape the pegs and fall off straight away. A little bit deep in there. I've come a long way since yesterday. I've come a long way since yesterday, but I'm still terrible at the game in reality. But with upgraded tyres now, it certainly helps. Although, we have got tyre wear on, so they will wear out across the course of this lap. I've done all this bit before, so it's not to say I'm guaranteed not to fall off by any means. There's other parts suck. I would ne we never would have done before. Maybe a little bit of a break for the next one. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. These tyres are absolutely delightful. Makes a massive difference. Oh, the rear end tried. It tried. It did step out on me, but we managed to recover it. Doing all right so far. That's whole two minutes of no crashing. Huge. Why have none of you told me to do tyres before? Well, in this stream, I suppose it makes sense. You want more gifted subs, but... <laughs> that was very close. Give me trouble here. I've crashed into that barrier on the right there before. We survive it, though. It's, it's been... Yeah, that eased up on the, on the steering so I could bounce up the kerb. All right. That's the first course that I know. Three minutes odd. Tell you what, if I do this without falling off, that is a turn up for the books. I'm certainly trying to because it costs me £4 per crash. I probably will crash at some point. That's now four minutes straight with no crashes. The upgrades certainly do help. Turn! He didn't turn! Oh, God's sake. I was doing so well. I was absolutely loving life. Imagine that. That would have been the dream to do the whole thing without a single crash. Don't mind me. Just using that tiny little lay-by there for a tiny bit extra track. I needed it. We're still doing all right, you know. We're still doing all right. I haven't done this bit before. Well, I haven't had another set of time, so I think I must have done this bit before. Yeah, big old bump there. Wasn't ready for it. Didn't know the track well enough. Big old bump. Oh, do you know what? Although I would never do it in real life because it's terrifying, I can see why this, this place is special. I can see why the Isle of Man TT is special from thanks to this game. I now I do have a newfound appreciation for not only the achievement of what the riders do. <sighs> just get it stopped. Quite nice, actually, in the end. Ju just for understanding why they do it. Like, to get it right, it just must feel absolutely sensational. So, I, I, I get it. I would never do it myself because it's too terrifying for me. I'm too scared, but I get it. I get it. Thanks to this game. Yeah, 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 yeah. Doing okay. We've got a penalty somewhere. Half a second penalty. We're nine minutes in. In theory, we should be about halfway through, but I suspect probably not. There's the 51 last signs. We're pretty much always doing more than that. Ooh, bit of air there. The bike did get a bit unsettled. We survive it. Uh-oh. Just straight over the curb. We got away with it. It's a very tight section of the course, this. Pretty certain I've not driven this area ever. We didn't. Ooh. I had to control it there, not only to stop the lock-up and while well, also continue on the brakes, but to keep it out of the wall. We do manage it. Turn. Stay away from the curb and the walls. Oh, God. So, this feels so narrow. It's amazing. Because I bet if you drive this in real life, it's, it doesn't feel that narrow. It just feels like a normal road. When you're doing these sort of speeds, threading it between a big curb and a, and a bush, it feels so incredibly narrow. Nah. Back end stepped out of me. The back end stepped out of me. I couldn't survive that one. I tried. I tried to hold on to it, but the back end said no. These must, these must sound absolutely awesome as well. Good. Yep. Two crashes in quick succession. We were doing relatively well. I mean, this is this is a new bit of the track, so at least at least the. <sighs> at least the bits that I was new, I was doing all right on. That's the one. The one saving grace. Oh, this feels bumpy up here. Never ridden this part. That's the close to the 
more you don't ever want to get. Oh, good. Yeah. Oh, it's going so well. It was going so well. I was actually looking like I sort of semi know what I'm doing on this game. Not anymore. I'll head south. Oh, good. I'm into deep again. Ah! Wow. That was a God's sake, man. That's the seventh crash of this run. I believe. The main issue is that I just don't know the course, but even so, it just shows the challenge of getting a lap of this length together. And I hear that they apparently do six lap races. Six laps of this. Look, look, how, look at the levers. Look how dirty I am now with all those crashes. It's not a big surprise. I'm way back, though. I, I, despite the crash, there's still, there's still an outside chance I might do it less than 20. Oh, that's a nice turn. That is it. That, I bet that in real life, although terrifying because you're doing 250k with that drop, I bet that feels right when you get that right because you can carry a lot of speed through there. Just survive. Just survive. I've crashed here before. Not today. Not today. We actually might do this in under 20 still, I reckon, because I think I feel like we're over three quarters of the way around. I'm not going to count penalties, by the way. Just putting that out there right now. I don't even know what the penalty's for, but I've certainly not done anything massive to gain an advantage. Ooh, that was close. Crash hit four as well. The rear end went on me there, but I just got it stopped enough to get around the corner, and it also settled itself down enough before the corner. You so regularly, these bikes are ridiculous, but you so regularly get up to 200, you know, almost 300k. 250k plus is just all the time. But then, less than 100k out of that, out of that turn. Or you're doing 200k. Takes a lot longer to get from 250 to 300. And even then, it doesn't go much above 300. Wait, round? Is there a white circle around the minimum that tells you how far? Because if that... Don't look at it while you're riding, Alex. If that tells us how far we're through, then we are, we're potentially going to do this in under 20. I'm cautious now. But I've got the margin. Yeah, I've done this bit before as well. It's, this bit's ridiculously tight. Oh, almost went too tight. Even, even idled then, pulled the clutch in. Oh. This is the finish. We're going to do it in well under 20. Well under 20. Let's go. 20 minutes and what? 18 and a half minutes. Beautiful. Beautiful. I mean, there was a few crashes, if we're completely honest. Add a, add a half a second penalty. But eight crashes, I think. Eight crashes. And we did it in under 20. Comfortably in the end as well, with multiple crashes. Right, anyway, guys, shall we get you gifted? How many is it? Was it, what do I see? 33, 33. That's still, it's actually less than I thought it was going to be, if I'm completely honest with you. But that's still quite a lot of gifted subs I've got to give to myself. £131.67 coming out of my bank account for crashing 33 times. There you go. Confirmed. Ah! Alex underscore Gillen just gifted 33 subs. There it is. I'm a man of my word. Alex Gillen just gifted 33 subs to the Alex Gillen channel. <laughs> Honestly, I really enjoyed this. Um, I love playing different games. And I, I love the approach to me. Hey, Alex, do you want to play this game? You know, it's absolutely awesome. I've enjoyed every moment of it. So thank you so much, guys, for joining me. Um, I'll probably, probably take a little break from it for now. And maybe perhaps over the, over the real life uh, Isle of Man TT, maybe we'll give this game another go and see if we can do a full course without any crashes. Anyway, guys, thanks so much for joining me.